Oh, hi. Is that a good snooze you were having or what? Stretch. Hi, buddy. Puppy vaccine day today, if you can hear me. for sure coming Saturday, I think six, coming on seven. They came yesterday. They actually weren't gonna get with these puppies. They're gonna put a deposit on a different litter. But puppy puppy cuteness overcame them, so. You ready, babies? You ready for your shots? this Junko. It must be the biggest one. Unfortunately, I can't weigh them because a goat got a hold of my scale cord and chewed it to pieces. I haven't been able to get a new one yet. Who's this one? This is George. He's the sweetest puppy ever. Yes, he is. There's nobody else. They get to this age and they have too much fun. That's why when my buyers come, they ask to let the puppies out. These days I say no, because I used to say yes, but the puppies disappear. Up there, and everywhere else, and they disappear. And then you can't see them anyway, so... I've started telling people they can go in the pen with them, but we're not taking them out, because if we take them out, you're not going to see them. What are you doing? Y'all just watching the goats? What are you doing? You're so weird. Rawr. Rawr. What chuckles? There's some more puppies. I think I'm gonna go bring all my dogs for a walk. Although it's quite cold, but can't have dogs here when for the weather, right? The tricky thing is going to be getting away without all these things chasing me. Sometimes you have to run really fast. But they're kind of distracted right now, so maybe I can go. I need to get over here though. They're gonna see they're going they're they're gonna beat me there.
Oh no. Take your eyes off of me. Do not. Okay, let's see. This is scout stuff. This is the first time he's gone on a walk. He has been around all these dogs just a little bit on leash. He hasn't really met any of them though, except for Vienna. Free. Every year, some farmer, if some farmer's implement isn't high enough, and they scratch up the road. This year it was dad. Oops! I like to have him off leash sometime by himself. He's not going to be with the other dogs for quite a while. Until he get him e-collar conditioned and get his recall down. Well, that goes for dogs or no dogs. Because we have that road right there. And he has a problem with cars, so I'm going to take off on me and get killed. It's Essie for you. Getting zoomies. Try and see if she can get someone to come with her. I don't encourage my dogs to chase and play with each other when they're running around walks. Because you get too many of them and they're going way too fast. Border collies, tensions get too high, someone gets hurt, and then someone gets mad. And we're talking five or six dogs, it's not a good recipe. Good boy. I really like how he acts around Clark, but he hasn't done anything yet, so... I guess I was missing someone. Haha! <laughs> Got too many dogs, don't keep track of them anymore. He's got a little bit of timidity to his problems, but I don't think it's that much. Because obviously this should be really triggering. All these dogs getting right in his face, especially Teal trying to bump him with her chin and nose there. And he's never had much of a problem with my dogs. He's never snapped at one of my border collies. Snapped at a couple goldens. Um, obviously in town the trigger, I mean, it, I don't know if he's in town where he learned the habit and he was never allowed to do it here or what, but in town is where he's, like it looks like he's just fine. He absolutely is not. He doesn't like puppies because they're rude and obnoxious. I don't know if he's that scared of them as much as he just doesn't like them. And because he's not a completely crazy dog, he tries to avoid them because he doesn't like them, rather than telling them off and being mean, which is good. He's definitely not comfortable around puppies, though. You been digging? You been digging? Okay, let's go. Let's go. Come on, Fiona. Let's go. 